I am Erica Chase. Samson. This is Samson, and he's my best friend, and I love him. Erica Chase. <laughs> I am playing Becca. I am a lovely, fun, loving sister. Um, I've got a great relationship with um, Amber, who's going to be playing Blair, and it's a lot of it is about camaraderie, family, friendship, um, but also just like the struggles that come. Aww with being around someone you love and how you can hurt someone you love without even really meaning to, I think. Yeah. I'm not actually, um, I'm from the South all through and through. It's, uh, I was born in Virginia, grew up in North Carolina, and I've been in Atlanta about three years. I have actually, um, I think my heart and soul is always gonna like, be there like it's is there something to be said for you have more freedom and you have the ability to get across some messages that like within the mainstream you you don't always get to follow through with like some of those inklings or desires or or messages like and I really appreciate that um and I really appreciate women driven projects I really just I think that it's so cool that Atlanta has a market where and like the indie thing, it isn't a struggle. It's not like something that you would look at as derogatory as opposed, it's more like, it's like the up and up. It's like the community coming together and making a difference. Um, most recently started working on like some sketches. I think some people like put like humor, like a little bit lower tiered, but I think there's a lot of beauty in it. And um, I we wrote and directed this tiny little thing and I had no idea like a page and a half of something would be so much work and struggle. Um, and even as prepared as we thought we were, we weren't. Um, but then like got premiere, we taught ourselves how to edit it. And it just, it was a really fun experience. And I guess that's about as indie as you get. <laughs> I think it would be, there's a feature film I shot in Atlanta right before I moved to Atlanta. So a couple of years ago now, and they got me, my character is kind of quirky and fun. And I was like, oh, this is epic. And they got me this cool car for my character to drive. It was a stick shift. And I can't drive a stick shift. And they literally had to um, roll me into the shot. <laughs> like, so when you see me coming to the parking spot, it's in, it's in neutral. And I just hit the brakes. And like on the other side, there's like four like guys pushing the car <laughs> into the shot. <laughs> this is probably like the most interesting thing so far. Yeah. I've been lucky enough not to lose anyone physically, like like them succumb to like an overdose or something, but I've had quite a few friends where uh, them being on it has, has ruined friendships. It's insane to like know, regardless of how long you've known someone or how much you care for them, that sometimes they'll always have secrets. And it's it's nothing against them. You know, it's like they're they're still a great person. They're still a beautiful person, but it is it is sad to see the extent like that people go for happiness. And and I think in the long run, it's just that pursuit of happiness. And sometimes we find methods that aren't the best to get there, but that that doesn't make you a worse person. But it definitely it does. It hits kind of close to home. It, I've, I've lost a few people. I like I said, not to death, but like I've I've lost them. Gushers, yeah. gushers. I love gushers. It's like if I don't see that on a set, I'm sad. The other thing I will say is, have you ever been on a set that didn't have Lacroix? I feel like I always see. There's always Lacroix, there's always LaCroix. Yeah. and it's like it's, it's not it's something. Necessary. It is. But you'll like you'll never not see it now. It's in the universe. It's weird. <laughs>